hey y'all hey welcome back to the channel so today's video is so exciting because there's birth there's life but with that comes death and things don't always work out how you want them to work out but just know there's a rhyme and a reason for everything and when something is happening it is to teach you a lesson it is also to protect what is remaining that is most important and you'll see that throughout this video when i talk about life and i talk well when you see life and when you see death um and this may not be the video for you who knows but we're going to get into this video first i'm going to show you the garden was growing was not growing the starts that i'm going to have to buy and i don't feel bad about cheating on it and neither should you while cheaters never win in gardening if you cheat and buy starts you at least eat cheat to eat if that's what you have to do grow in buckets grow in containers grow out of the bag itself that the soil comes in just put a little extra amendments in it make you a raised bed or whatever you want to grow in just grow your own food guys our food is being controlled by so many different hands in the pot that don't want us to depend on ourselves they want us to depend on them and I hope that this channel helps you see from the news stories that you can use to the gardening videos that you can grow your own food and you can take control of what you eat. If you eat out, that's fine. Go ahead and do that. I eat out sometimes. Sometimes I don't feel like cooking. But know what you're eating because nowadays so many things are labeled incorrectly to fool you it'll say gluten-free but it's not it'll say you know sugar-free but it's not they have so many ingredients in there that you don't even know what it is say you're buying pepper buy the whole peppercorns and grind them up yourself because what's inside of those peppers that's already been ground up for you is wood pulp in other things as a filler as a buffer it's not actual pepper grow your own food let's see what's going on in the rest of this video What's up, y'all? Good morning. Good morning. I look rough, but it's all good. It's all good in the hood. So today, well, hey, y'all. Hey, <laughs> today is Saturday and today is actually, um, what is it? Seven for the Flemish Giant Kids. And today is day 31 for the New Zealand Red Rabbit that I have. So, I'm not seeing anything. It's the same little bit of fur that she pulled last night. But I'm going to pull this closer to me and just see. Because maybe she'll have them today. I'm looking around. I don't see anything in here. So, okay. So, she has that. I'm gonna look in here. I don't think anything's in here, but because I don't see anything moving, she doesn't have a lot of fur. Well, she hasn't matted down, so we'll see. Maybe it's underneath here. Who knows? Oh, she has a lot of fur in here. I didn't realize she had done such a great job. But. She have a baby. I mean a kid. So let's see what she has. I'm going to take it out and then look in it. Got them way back there too. Huh? You can see a little bit of movement. It's two. Let's 
see. Oh, she had a, she had a, oh my gosh. Oh my, oh my gosh. She had a lot. I'm not sneezing right now. Go that far. But there they are. One, two, three, four, five, six. So she has six. I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of fur back there like she had it. So that was very exciting. She had six babies. She did a great job as far as having them and figuring it out. She figured it out way faster than Lily did. Um, so now I'm about to check on the Flemish Giants. I got to give Lily some hay. So I decided to take Lily's babies out and actually look at them because I have not done that and they get they're getting so big. Now that's the smallest one. He needs to be eating. He's not eating. He's not getting any food. So I don't know if he's gonna make it or not he is really he or she is really compared to the other ones not getting any food they're getting all of the food look at this one compared to the one i just showed you i can't even get him all the way in my hand so so small they're not you look at them compared to the rest of them it's just not getting any food so it's two really small ones I mean, their heads, nothing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sure, I'm not missing anything back there. Yeah. Put that little one next to that one. You see the difference? It's like they're starving to death. So this is my first set of eggs that I've sold. I'm so excited about Seven that. Dozen. I am now selling eggs, y'all. Eggs for sale, eggs for sale. Hey, y'all, hey. Good morning, welcome back to the channel. So I'm just getting out the door. Had to do a lot of things on the computer. And of course I had to have my sermon before I come out here. Head over to the rabbits because I'm gonna lump all these videos together to make them one video hopefully not too long and please try to watch it as much of it as you can and hit that like button to get it in the algorithm also I have this sticky bush tree here that's out of control that we're gonna have to cut down we had said we was gonna cut it down but we definitely gonna have to cut it down now because the one 
on the opposite end over here, it has bees in it, birds in it. And the other day inside of my sunroom, there was a huge bumblebee. So they found a way in and I told my husband, that tree gotta go. He's like, we gotta wait till fall. So it's a really hot day. And I do believe today's the day I'm gonna get in this pool. We have gotten in this pool, me and my youngest child. Oh, I need, my duck is leaning. I know what that means. That means I need to add another. I need to add it, probably two more of these chlorine tablets. Because he got the gangster lean, y'all. Look at him. He got the gangster lean. So my pool has been doing really well this year since we changed the pump out. I'm so happy about it. I do have a video showing you how I cleaned this pool out. And I just have not edited that video yet. And I need to edit it. I'm, I don't know if I'm going to put it on this channel or if I'm going to put it on uh, Tommy Bites TV Life. I don't know. But I need to put it up. Look at him. Gangsta Lane. Anyway, look here. Girls, I need to clip your wings. But not today. So, right now, I need to give them some more water and shake their food down because there's food in there. Okay, so this is my Flemish giant here. This is Lily. These are her kits in here. I'm going about to take them out. Oh, look, I can see in there. She don't have them covered. I guess she was feeding them. Let's see if you can see in there. So cute. So, and then this is Little Red Riding Hood, my Red New Zealand rabbit here. Her kits are in there. She just had hers. Today is actually, honestly, she could have had them that day I came out and I thought that she didn't have enough fur in there because it was so compacted in there. She might have already had them that day, which would have been day 30. So she either had them day 30 or day 31. Either way, this is probably around, that would have been Saturday. That would have been Friday or Saturday. So I'm going to say day 31 she had them. Um, after midnight because I had checked the last time it was like 1130 <laughs> at night um, so we're going to say day 31 she had them so that would be um, Saturday so Sunday, Monday Sun no, this, today is day one or day two with them so hopefully you can see them because the sun is like crazy um I just need to make sure that those little tiny ones are have not passed away. So 
so these two well this one is already gone this one is barely hanging on these were the two that were just not eating not able to get to her nipples like the other ones so they will definitely be discarded um buried so here's the rest and you don't want to leave them in there like that because it could cause the rest of them to pass so there's two three should have five now four big rabbits one two one two three four five sadly we went from nine down to five um see their eyes are not open Let me put over here their eyes are not open yet so cute it's too early to sex them so they're doing good they're eating these were the ones that were able to eat you know and they definitely been doing that so I'm gonna put their fur back in and put give them back to mom and then we'll go check on the newly born ones so here are her babies I'm not even gonna take all her fur out or maybe I will I need to make sure they're living. Okay, so here are five babies that have full bellies. I checked them off camera. Still got all five of them. They've been eating. Of course, these are New Zealand. This one's definitely been eating. Look at his belly. You probably can see the white in it. If you see white in it, that's like milk. Only one is like small, but even the small one has a round belly, so he has been getting, he or she has been getting food. So I'm gonna put them back. I like how she has her down here in the hole. I think I'm gonna put that little one on top. Put him in last. Get in there, buddy. In there, she had them packed in there. Here, everywhere. So, I'm about to discard of these two rabbits. I'm sorry, I can't really see because I got hair everywhere. But that ends this video, you guys. Y'all take care. Stay safe. Have a blessed day. I'll see you in the next video. Remember, I love you, but God loves you more. He created only one you. Be the best you that you can be. And when you are, go out and spread God's love. Whew. Bye.
可。